Welcome back to the program, young Ro. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Let me just say to those people who may hop on the internet and want to Google you, the, the name is spelled Y-U-N-G. Yes, Y-U-N-G-R-O. You can, you can Twitter me at Young Ro BP. That's at Y-U-N-G-R-O-B-P, as in Black Pro, Young Ro BP. Facebook the same, or MySpace is the same. Everything. I mean, you're everywhere. Yes. Yeah, everywhere. which is one of the things that is very impressive about you, is how well you have uh, taken advantage of marketing. And I mean, you're just all over it. You really are. But look, before we get into that, I want to get back to... Um, your Runway to Empowerment organization. We were talking about some of the, the um, areas that you speak on, including the STD education and prevention, healthy living and education, crime and violence prevention. And the other area that I want to talk briefly about is dropout and illiteracy in St. Louis. It's crazy. Yes, very crazy. It's very crazy. And, uh, you know, like, I, I stress that the most. Like, like education is a must. You know, I, I, college may not be for you. You know, like, I, I, I'm not going to college, you know. And I really do want to, you know, but sometimes I, I'm just waiting to see how my career plays out for me. You know, actually, but high school, you have to. You have to get your high school education. You know, it will only make you better, you know. It will only make you better. A lot of, a lot of the, these days we have kids that are dropping out and that are... That are, um, you know, that just can't read and write, and then they wonder sometimes why they can't get a job. And, you know, and I really just, I just want to help them out instead of coming down hard on them. You know, yeah. I kind of want to, you know, help them like teach them how to fill out, fill out a job application. Mm -hmm. You know, like so, even though I never had a job, I'm still, <laughs> I still know how. You no, know? you don't have a job. You have several. You have <laughs> several jobs. I'm yes. telling you. So you know, teach them how to fill out a job application. Or you know. Um, I just really want to encourage them to finish high school, you know, finish high school, then, then make a decision on what you want to do in life, you know, from now, yeah. you, you're pretty much, once, you, once you're 18, you you know, you're pretty much, you're getting grown, once yeah. you're out your mama's house. Okay, once you're so out your mama's house, I like that. You know, but definitely, you definitely should, should finish high school, it will only make you better, I can't stress that enough, it will only make you better, like, how do you want to be an entertainer and you can't, and you can't write? Right. Or, you know, you can't, your, your vocabulary isn't very wide, you know, like, how, how, how does it work, I don't understand, and people get scholarships, you get scholarships, you know, through sports, whether you want to be mm -hmm. an athlete, you know, you would, it's, it's still pretty, have to. you still have to have an education, you know, you have to keep good grades to maintain, to stay on the team, so, you know, and I used to play basketball, like I said earlier, you yeah. know, so I know about having good grades to stay on the team, you know, I had friends that, that could that didn't make the cut because because of their grades, mm -hmm. you know, they were very talented, mm -hmm. you know, there's plenty of talented people here in St. Louis, but I, I just really, I really say the, the ones who are, there are some that are talented that don't have the, the good grades to stay on the team. Mm -hmm. You know, I really encourage them. I go out where I will help them. You know, maybe we can, I can give me a little pile. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, they can roll with me and we do homework, study, <laughs> there you, buddy, go. you know what I'm saying? There Something you go. like that. Be like a mentor. Yeah, mentor. So that's awesome. That is very awesome. Okay, so now I want to ask you this. How important is it for you and your career and what you're doing with the Empowerment, Runway to Empowerment organization to kind of expand and, and uh, expand your message and reach other audiences, such as here at MS Communications, you know, KC95, K-Hits 96, we have Alternative Rock, you know, really, yes. kind of outside of the hip-hop box. How exactly. important is that? That's, it's, it's really big, it's really big, because one thing that I, I stress, you know, that if we want to re-nourish the Midwest music scene, period, I feel like whether we're pop, country, rock, you know, whatever it is, hip-hop, we should all support one another. You know, and, and I definitely support that. I, I'm even looking forward to, you know, collabing, doing anything. But as far as one way to empowerment, mm -hmm. I would love to take it outside of hip hop and reach everywhere. It really is just, just to start, like I said. Right. And, and, you know, it, it's all about just, just being patient and really taking it to that level. But I'm moving up. And anybody who's listening to this, if you would like to, you know, contact me and give me, want me to come help out, you know, I'm willing to do whatever. If it's, if it's anything positive, I'm with it, you know. Yeah, I Definitely. love that. So you can reach out and you can contact me. You can tweet me, Young Grow BP, Google me, Young Grow. Mm -hmm. you, know, I'm kind of, you know, you can contact my email, Young Grow BP at Gmail. All right, very good. BP at Gmail.com.
gmail.com. <laughs> Young grow BP at gmail.com. So what's in the future for you? You're only 18. You, you want to get married, have kids. What? Why? <sighs> And you Man. find that funny. Yeah. And I will at eighteen I'm kind of I'm kinda of happy for that because you've got a lot of living to do. You know, you really shouldn't yeah. be thinking about all of that right yeah. now. Really exactly. I'm just I'm focused on my career, honestly. And, uh, but you I like just, the girls. Yeah. I you love admit the girls. it to it. I love hey, they they, they feel the economy right now. You know, man, they do everything. We get fly for women. You know, you have to understand this. We go out to the club to see women, you know. <laughs> And that's and that's kind of what I and women support music right now. That's true. Honestly, they, they're really they're really keeping a lot of artists hot right now. Yeah, including you. Including me. Yeah. All right. So let's go over the information one more time. If you want to learn more about uh, Young Row and his music and the tattoo business, I mean it's all right there. The wonderful uh, website. It's bpent. Dot net bpent dot net. It's got the information regarding his career and the other up and coming artists on his indie label Black Pearl Entertainment. It has the information on the tattoo shop that uh, he will become the CEO of. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. And then also the marketing. Oh my gosh, you guys, the marketing. You guys do flyers, wonderful flyers, and social marketing yes. for up and coming artists. Yes, if you and. Let me let me throw this in there. If yes. you need a free photo shoot, we do this for for independent artists. We give them free photo shoots down at Black Pearl on Thursday. On Thursday. Every Thursday, you know, we'll we'll give we'll give independent artists free photo shoots. Yes. And his videos, uh, Freshen in the Mall and uh, Fresh Freshen in Fresh in the Mall. <laughs> I can't say it. <laughs> Number three on Billboard R and B and hip hop music sales. Also dunk that. Yes. Uh, that's your another booty song. So if you like that, check it out. And that's all available too. And you also have a YouTube TV site too. Yes, my YouTube. Fun. Oh yeah, I can't forget about the YouTube. Mm -hmm. Go to my YouTube. That's Young Grow BP. Got my whole YouTube channel. I got over 30 videos of just over. shows and you know upcoming singles and blog updates. Everything just actually make my YouTube right. And I'm, I've got your mother over here to the right of me. Uh, Miss Tracy is what I like to call her. And, and uh, I just wanted to, in your own words, you know, your mom and your dad, those are the people who really instilled this stick to itiveness, this drive for success in you. Yes. yes, they did. They are the backbone of my career right now. I love my, my father, my mother so much and they, they help me out so much they keep my head clear they keep me focused they keep me from around the negative people that i don't need to be around because i know like you know even without i i, I barely have any friends just to be honest yeah so you know even you're without, working too hard so you know even without <laughs> any friends you know that my parents kind of let me know you know everything's going to be all right be all right bro you know i'm kind of they're there to pat me on the back keep but they going, know like, they know and then my parents told me this when i was young in your age is that you know you're not gonna your true friends are going to be very little in number you're going to be able to count that on one or two or three fingers if that you know your associates are going to be wide and those those fans are going to be even wider but the people that most matter to you are the ones that you can do one or two three fingers you know and those are your friends and of course you can never go wrong when you've got that locked tight family which yes. is very important so. and very rare very people, rare a lot of people don't have the chance to have no mother and no father in their life. That's right. You know, so kind of you are blessed. Life. The doctor in the emergency room was right. And you hit it right on the head. You are blessed in so many ways. And we appreciate you joining us here on today's issues. And we wish you well with all of your successes. And we just want to say it one more time. If you are a corporation that deals with youth organizations or even an organization, a corporation that wants to share the youth experience with your adult crowd, Young Row would be an excellent, excellent uh, person to invite to come talk and also um, to your youth organizations, your schools and things like that. And check them out on the web. If you don't believe me, see it for yourself. It's uh, B P E N T. Dot net. Young Ro, thank you. No, thank you for having me. Appreciate it.